Currently, beef cattle are a large industry in the U.S., contributing a lot to the economy of this country. However, changes in customer demand and regulation related to food quality and safety are changing the industry. In the United States, beef cattle are raised in a variety of ways, from grazing to factory farming and large farms. Farmers often use modern techniques such as breeding, healthcare, diet, and environmental management to ensure the health and productivity of these cows. Selected cow breeds are resistant to diseases. Ranchers often choose cows that are good and have high growth potential. After selecting the breed, the cows are taken care of fully and thoughtfully. This includes providing adequate food, ensuring health and hygiene care. Cows are also vaccinated to prevent diseases. When the cows are old enough, they are put on a special diet to enhance meat performance and ensure health. The cows are grazed in pastures or raised in factories. According to the United States Department of Agriculture, USDA, by 2021, the total number of beef and dairy cows in the United States will be about 94.4 million heads. in which the number of beef cows is about 33.7 million head and the number of dairy cows is about 9.3 million heads. The remaining cows are breeding cows, crossbreed cows and other cows. The slaughter of beef cattle in the United States is done in meat processing plants. These plants are strictly regulated by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration FDA, and are periodically inspected to ensure food and safety quality. The slaughter process begins with the cow being brought into the meat processing plant. Before being sent to the slaughterhouse, cows will be checked for health to make sure they are not sick. Sick cows are not allowed to enter the slaughterhouse. The cows are then taken to the slaughterhouse where they will be slaughtered and cleaned. Slaughtering is carried out by specially skinned and fully trained workers. When cows are slaughtered, Internal organs are removed and examined for any signs of infection or abnormalities.
After the cow has been slaughtered and cleaned, the meat will be cut into different parts for use. Trained workers will cut the meat into small portions and pack them in preparation for shipping or supermarkets and grocers. Slaughtering and meat processing are strictly controlled to ensure the safety and quality of meat products. Meat processing plants are often required to comply with food safety. and hygiene regulations set forth by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration FDA, to ensure that the meat products meet safety standards and quality. Merci. Hi everyone, do you often use meat? Please write back in this video, see the process of raising and processing beef at the factory. Currently, there are many smart cow farms designed with modern technologies to help better manage and take care of cows. These technologies include automatic monitoring system, automatic feed systems, temperature and humidity control systems, waste treatment and water reuse systems. After the cows are cared for and raised on the farm, the beef will be processed in modern beef processing plants. These plants are often equipped with equipment and technology to help process and process beef more quickly and efficiently. Before cows are slaughtered, they are usually inspected to ensure food safety and health. These examinations are performed by veterinary professionals or by personnel with relevant training and certification. Cows are placed in pretreatment area where they will be treated with food safety and health related matters such as cleaning and sanitizing, shaving and nail trimming. Cows are brought into an anesthetic area where a veterinary specialist will inject anesthetic so that the cow will lose consciousness and feel no pain during slaughter process. Here, the staff will remove unusable parts such as skin, digestive organs and other parts. 
After that, the meat will be cut into small pieces. The large butchers are now working. These workers separate the meat pieces separately and glue the quality certificate. Bovine organs are also cleaned. The beef will be filtered through filters to remove impurities, bones and unusable skin. After being cleaned, the meat will be cut and divided into different parts according to customer requirements or specific product. Next beef is packaged into smaller units to suit customer needs. Usually, beef will be packed in vacuum bags or plastic containers. Prior to retail packaging, beef is re-inspected for quality to ensure that the product meets feed safety and quality standards. Important product information such as product name, weight, expiring date, origin information, and storage instructions will be recorded on the product packaging. Are you curious how the cow hide will be treated after peeling? They become leather products. After skinning, Cells and soft tissues are separated from the cow hide. This process is usually done using cutting and scrapping tools. After separating the soft tissues, the hair and the bones remaining on the cowhide are removed to become leather. To remove impurities and increase skin suppleness, chemical treatment is applied. This includes using chemicals to bleach and remove dirt and impurities left on the skin. After going through the above step, the leather will be dried and surface treated to remove dirt and impurities remaining on the leather surface. Finally, the leather will be cut into pieces and processed into leather products such as bags, shoes, belts, wallets, etc. Thank you. This video has brought you useful information and helped you answer your questions. If you have any questions or comments, leave a comment below. And don't forget to support us by liking and subscribing to our channel so you don't miss the latest videos.